pies that I've got a peacock. Hello, oh, welcome back. Thanks for coming back, downtown Kedapapos. Truly, truly spectacular evening indeed. If you're wondering where we are in the month, well, we're in the third week of June. The temperature's ramped up. Summer has arrived. That's the most beautiful woman in the world who has the odd problem or two with her pronunciation. And of course, her name is Miss Ochin Prasidiana Booth. Hello, everybody. How nice to see you again and again. How's your peacock? It's the best peacock. It is, yes. How's your peacock, Mr. Mark? Let's keep going. Down the Cape of Paphos Promenade, if you're wondering about a restaurant or two, well, over there is the Bacchus restaurant. Probably one of the best restaurants on the downtown Cape of Paphos Promenade. And if you look just over there, there's a man in a blue t-shirt and there's a man sitting down. That's a man called Mr. Chris. If you want to rent a car in downtown Paphos, Chris Car Rental is probably the rental company for you. An honourable man, a man who's been in hire cars for more than 30 years in Paphos. He's got a branch literally next door to the Basilica Resort and another branch across to the Coral Bay Beach and Resort Hotel. So two of the best locations and some very, very good cars indeed at reasonable prices for you. And of course you can get them delivered to the airport waiting for you as well. Luckily it's got a little, the air's got a little bit of breathe which makes our work much more easier and enjoyable. It does indeed. There's a slight breeze on the air now as the sun starts to descend and go off to see our superstar all the way over in downtown Adelaide in Australia. Of course, her name is Miss Helen, and we have the great honour and pleasure to meet her and her husband, Neophytus, not that long ago. Of course, time does go, and they're going to come back next year. Of course, next year will be upon us very, very soon indeed. Gift shop after gift shop. Rip. Rip. My English is gone. Restaurant after restaurant along the downtown Kedapathos Promenade. And of course, as the sun goes down, the business goes up because all the people come storming out of their apartments and out of their hotels and of course they're looking for something to eat, something to drink and something to party on. Receiving? Do you know it's a shame many times we don't film what we're eating and the prices of the restaurants are different dishes I mean because many we don't add it and many times it's some music playing in the restaurants or bars otherwise we would have show you the huge selection of the food that we had have, well, we have had in Cyprus. We have everywhere. indeed. Very, very hard to make a restaurant uh, video without doing editing, and we don't edit. Very, very simple. There's a Gumbara over there. That's Mr. Polis. If you want to get yourself tattooed, that could be Hello. the man for you. Basically, you come along and you have a word with him. He's a nice chap. He's just setting up for the night. If you want a little bit of ink on you, this is the man for you. It could be for a special wedding or an anniversary. It could be something very, very simple. He's chucking me the books frantically. But I think you get the idea of what you want. If you want your hand done like that, it's about 25 euros. If you want your best, best friend. He's got a queue, Mr. Paul. He's got an awful lot of them. An awful lot of them. And there's people queuing up to get tattooed. He's going to make a couple of bob tonight, that's for sure. Just over here is the Captain's View restaurant, and down below is the Captain Bistro. And this is a guy called Lars, or Lazarus for short, should we say. How are you doing? I'm fine, my friend. Looking very cool, as usual. I always, I always, my friend. You see, we have the best place here. You yeah? do. I'm pretty busy indeed. Nice day. Okay. There we are. People There's a man here. running away over there. He's yeah. shy on camera. We shy, my friend. We're very friendly here. You can be famous, my dear. Yes. Oh, terrible. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you very much. <laughs> What's you your name? Your Kathy. Kathy. Right. This man's running away. <laughs> your name's not Grant. Right. What's yeah, your name? Right. Paul. Yes, Paul. Paul. What a great name. Great, great name. Yeah, no, Absolute stars. Um, Lovely yeah, to meet you. Thank you very much. Thank you. You never have to watch again. We promise you. We promise you. Let's keep going down the head of Paphos. That's Lars. If you want a great meal? That's the man to go and see. And you never know if you whisper in your ear that you've seen us on Marika and me, you might get a little discount. Upstairs, as I was saying, it's the same restaurant, but of course that's the one with the spectacularity of a view out across the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. And to welcome you at that door is that man. Look at him, all dressed head to toe in blue. Blue t-shirt, blue jeans, and look at them. Brand new blue shoes, <laughs> Mr. McKellis. How are you doing, you all right? Good. 
Oh. Yes, we're going to have a look. We're going to have a look. If you come here and if you mention to Michaelis that you've seen this restaurant on Marika and me, guess what? 10% off your bill. Simple as that. Whatever you have, whatever you drink, 10% off your bill. And you'll probably get a free drink as well. But you have to, don't forget to say our names to Michalis. He will arrange that one. Let's follow the rear end of the most beautiful woman in the world. Up this blue carpeted stairs into the little restaurant known as the Captain's View. And you're going to understand why it's called the Captain's View in a moment, because the view is going to take your breath away. It's a spectacular view out across the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea and into the abyss. Look at that. Doesn't get much better than that. This is the Captain's View restaurant on a truly, truly spectacular weekend. Look at that. Wow. Imagine sitting up here, digesting, having a drink, and looking out across that blue, 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 blue Mediterranean sea. Next time when we will be hungry and we will come here with somebody from our greatest family, depending who is going to be like next time, for And it will be reserved especially for you. This is going to be reserved because I realize this is our best table overlooking the Mediterranean Sea. You can walk, uh, watch people walking around. You've got a lovely bridge, by the way. I can't, I don't want to go out from Well, this we've got place. to go. We've got to keep going. So come on, receive the booth. Captain's View Restaurant, probably one of the best restaurants in downtown Ketapapos. The view from up here is truly, truly spectacular. The waitresses were all smiling as we walked in. It really is a great, great place indeed. And as you can see, even though it's early in the evening, it's getting busy. It's actually so nice, uh, but Listen, it's a little bit up and it's a little bit away from the edge of the harbour. That's why people don't maybe realise, but some people who do realise that there is such a place exists. Oh, uh, it's amazing view, it's such a lovely breeze, a nice and clean and cool, and the food here, especially if you are very fan of fishing, meze, or the meat as well, depending what you want. And I know that they've got a very rich menu and the prices are... And even better, with 10% off. And of course, if you want a gluten-free meal, all you've got to do is mention it to one of the waitresses, clarify it, that it makes sure it gets to the chef. And I'm promising you, you're going to get a gluten-free meal as well. Let's follow the most beautiful woman in the world as we transcend back down to the lower levels of the ground floor of the Paphos Promenade. That's the man in charge, Mr. McKellis. Don't forget to mention Marika and me to him. And we promise you, you're going to get a 10% discount. And you never know, you may even get a free Any, drink as well. Oh, Anytime. Okay. Thanks, Thank McKellis. We'll Thank see you a bit later. Right. Here's the start. He's worked this promenade for many, many years indeed. That restaurant's been there, again, for many, many, many years indeed. Lots of people know it for its great food, but of course, it's not a restaurant you can just walk in off the street. You've got to go up the stairs, if you understand me. But please, please, spare the time and go and have a look. Uh-oh, Mickey Mouse is in town. There he is. The superstar has flown in from downtown Florida. He wants the children, you see? Yeah, only wants the children, there we are. Look at that. Now he's hoping to get a couple of euros out of these people, that's for sure. He wants a picture or two. He is a legend. There we are. That's it. That's called live fleecing on camera, that's for sure. Absolute legends in downtown Kedopathos Promenade. Look at that. That's what it's all about. That's how it works. You see Mickey Mouse, you pop over, give him a couple of euros and he gets to take a picture or two with the most famous mouse in the entire world. And of course, we're going to keep on going down the Kedopathos Promenade. One or two more superstars are going to come up very, very shortly. That's, uh, I'm trying to think, who is it? Is it Rod Stewart or is it Constantinos? Ah, it's Constantinos. Constantinos is getting himself ready. He's getting a chair or two out. And if you want your name on a grain of rice, this could be the man for you. It can be on a bracelet. It can be on a necklace. It can be on a little charm to go on a bracelet. It can be on a little charm to go on your dog or your cat, your auntie or your uncle, whoever you want to put it on. He's just setting up, as we can see. He also does these true seashells. So these are shells plucked from the sea, which are then hand-painted especially for you by the legend known as Mr. Constantinus. And, of course, if you want 
a special, special one for someone very special in your life, like Miss Anna, our superstar, all the way out in Krakow. <laughs> there he is. That's the man himself hiding behind the board. So he pops up. How are you doing? Fine. Are you busy? It's okay. You're going to have a busy night tonight, I think. Okay. I really, really think you're going to be busy. There's some of the previous little things he's made. And there's lots of choices, so you can spend your time choosing the colour of that bracelet. You can have different roses in different colour, different dyes. There's all sorts of things. It all starts off at around about €8. Euros. The average price is normally around about 12 when he's finished with you, because he does like to up your budget that little bit. And, of course, he does like to stick a special little bit on the end of that name, and it always ends with a... Ooh, ooh, there we are. He likes to put a new in it, especially for you. And that's not because he drinks Thai food tea. That goes back a long way away. There was a Chinese gentleman that had his name. How many letters? 27. 27. And on the end of it? Ooh. ooh, there we are. That's the joke. The Chinese gentleman was laughing his socks off. His wife was falling over. And we were in absolute stitches as well. If only we would have filmed it, it probably would have got a million views. Do you know, I now realise, Mr. Paul is talking with Mr. Constantinos, and I'm realising that these people, already well known from the YouTube, from the people who are watching us, and they all of them are saying, uh, like one, that uh, people recognising us, and of course Mr. Paul, uh, Constantinos is already, already recognisable, a long, long way away, but these people, uh, the people like a Tito standing in front of the restaurants, they are so happy when people say to them, oh, we watched you, we have seen you. It does you. indeed, yeah. It makes the day, by the way. We're going to go and see if we can find Tito, because he was here when we walked up and down before, but now he seems to have gone all shy and dug it off. Perhaps he's gone to the toilet, or perhaps he's frog marching someone down the road. No, there he is, there he is. He's the most handsome man in the downtown Kedipapas Harbour. Got a great, great orange tie. Let's go and say hello to him, because he's got a mum and dad all the way out in Bulgaria. And uh, now and again, he likes to say hello to them. There he is. He hasn't spotted us. Yes, he has. You all right? How are you doing? Surprise me. I surprised hello. you. Snuck up behind you. Table for two? Table for four later. We'll see you a bit later. He's a busy, busy man. His job is to fill that restaurant. His job is to then make sure it's all perfect. And it's his job to make sure that you feel very, very special. He is Major Tito. Please go and pay him a visit and say a very, very big hello indeed. And it is understandable because any problem, any task happens in the restaurant, uh, any problem to solve, Mr. Tito is standing in front of the restaurant, so there is no other manager or director who they can see. So, of course, they can come to him with any troubles, and then it's huge responsibility. It is a big job he's got. Him. It is indeed. Now, there's one last superstar on this particular video. We're going to introduce him, and of course, he's a man all dressed in gold. Look at that. This is the new character in downtown Pathos. There he is. He's all dressed in gold. And again, if you want to get your picture taken with him, a couple of euros, and you get a picture taken of a legend in the downtown Paphos Arbor. And if you're lucky, you might get Grisivi Leboeuf to stand by the side of him. Yes, that's good, Barastofoli. He's a legend in downtown Paphos. He's the new attraction, but of course, that's the best attraction. And next door to Mr. Chris, by the way, is a very, very handsome man and a very, very rich man, and his name's Mr. Yanis. There we are. So if your name's Miss Iris, all the way out in downtown Antwerp in Bel Belgium, that could be the man for you. There he is. You right, Chris? You're looking very nice in blue. Have you been busy? Have you been busy? Don't lie to me, Chris. I don't lie to you. don't lie to me. He'd never lie to me. He wouldn't. What does he do? The greatest natural sea sponge salesman in the world. If you're looking for a special, special sponge, whether you want a small one, whether you want a big one, it's up to you which one you want. I would always go for the Whopper. I would not go to Burger King or McDonald's. I would buy that one, and I'd get myself a bun, some bacon, some cheese, and some sauce. Doom. Greatest burger you can ever going to get, correct? Of course, it tastes And you never know, he might even chuck in a large cock with it as well. You see, the gentleman has prepared the cigar. He is, yeah. And you haven't mentioned it. Well, he used to be known as the most famous and richest fisherman. If you go hunting back in our previous videos, he was always fishing with that cigar. Then we got actually to meet him, and then we found out not only is he the best fisherman in the world, but he also owns two multi, multi million euro villas on the Kisonaga seafront. So if you come back next week, Mr. Yanis is going to let us go and burgle those two villas, especially for you.
it's not the thing to have them and to look at them it's the thing we have to rent it and we have to find the lovely people who would like to spend the luxury holidays unforgettable time in the life so and we're gonna do it one day we're gonna come and I will be monkeying around and one day I will not leave that and I will sleep somewhere on the roof. Well I'm planning on staying in one of those villas for at least a couple of months. I haven't told him yet. Yasu <laughs> Gumbaru. He's a great guy by the way. We met him months and months ago. Thanks Chris. Months and months ago down behind the wood kiosk and he was fishing. But if you remember he did have that slight giveaway sign a big big cigar. And of course, well, he's a multi multi millionaire. And his two villas in downtown Kosonaga are worth around about three million euros each. And luckily for him, his mum and dad happened to own the land before he built them. So of course, he's got a couple of bob or two. Now, final superstar in downtown Kedapathos. She wants to braid the living daylights out of you. And she's not smoking tonight. So luckily her mum is allowed to watch and she's working instead. What does she do? Well, you choose the twines, obviously. You can plunge in there for a bead or two. Put a smile on her face and she's going to braid the living daylights out of you. There's some of her previous victims and each and every one of them lived to tell the tale. I understand it's a hard job as well, by the way. The people's wishes have to be done in the best way. And if uh, something go wrong, of course they have to be done. They do indeed. So we're going to say thanks for watching. If you like what you see, hit the like, click the subscribe. Perhaps come back for a little bit more of a madness. And of course, well, if you want to keep the channel float, why not click through to our about page where you could consider to buy us a coffee or two. All you got to do is hunt us down Google. Buy me a coffee, Marika and me, up it'll come. You can choose to register one of your cards and you can say thank you or a salute or whatever you want to call it. We don't mind. Or if you want us to make a special, special video for you, well, those few coffees and guess what? That video will be coming very, very soon. We would love to thank you from the bottom of our two hearts. Tell you how much we loving you and kissing you from the bottom of our two hearts. Thanks for watching. And of course, we will see you again very, very soon. <coughs>